Hi guys, welcome back. I am Red Z, and today we have a very special video with quality old games. We are going to be doing a one versus one, seeing who wins between the scythe chariots of the Seleucids versus the Galatian Thoracitae. And I'm really excited to do this video with you, quality old games. Thank you for joining me. Thank you. It's my pleasure to uh, join this video. Yeah, we're going to be doing, guys, we're going to be doing two videos on each of our channels. One video on mine, one video on quality old games. Uh, and then, uh, again, repeated. And, uh, yeah, check his channel out. It's really cool. Does a lot of 1v1 videos on classic Rome. So, perfect for you guys out there. Because I know how many of you love classic Rome Total War. Um, but without further ado, should we, should we click the start button? Yeah, I think we are ready. Yes. And, uh, yeah, time to charge the boys. Let's have a look. Let's see who wins, because, I, I don't know, like, I honestly think the Thorakitai are going to win, but we shall see. Let's see. I'm relying, relying on the crescent formation there, yeah. at least for the initial impact. I mean, the, the, it is quite an intimidating sight, I'm not going to lie, looking down from your Galatian Thorakitai. <laughs> Up the hill. <laughs> yeah, let's see. Uh, I don't actually remember playing against um, chariots in the in this mod. No. Before, so it's going to be a bit of surprise how well they are going to fare in the battle, at least for me. Yeah. Oh my God, your uh, the Thorakitai look absolutely stunning, don't they? Jesus Christ, I've forgotten how good they look. To be honest, I've not played with them for a while. Oh wait, they, like my chariots have uh, my chariots have archers. I forgot about that, but I'm okay. not gonna I'm not gonna I'm not gonna do that. But <laughs> here they come. Let's see what happens. A bit of a staggered charge, not the greatest, but <laughs> hopefully <Okay>. it'll work. <laughs> we'll see. Okay, there they go. Oh, they're gonna get too bogged down. Oh my days! <laughs> that is a mess. Okay. <laughs> Guys, get... Looks like the formation is holding quite yeah, well here. Yeah, doing quite well. I'm going to try and push through. I knew the Thorakitai would do well. They're such a heavy unit. See, chariot... Yeah, chariot's in the back. That's the ideal. Yeah. But they do look... They do uh, They do look fantastic. The chariots, though, charging in there. That... Honestly, that was really... They held that so much better than I thought they were going to... Yeah, but significant casualties, at least on my side. Yeah, let's have a look. Yeah, down 35%. I lost 15. 15%. But yeah. <laughs> Pretty... but it might actually be a bit higher number on your side because of the hit points. Yeah, yeah. Uh, I mean, 8 hit points these guys have, guys. 8 hit points with 18 total defense. It's pretty high. Um, of course, the special attack... They're mainly used, if you actually use them in-game in the single player, guys, then what you want to do is use them as a morale shock item, not to, you know, initially charge the enemy. They're also fantastic against cavalry. They are, like, chariots are certified cavalry killers, guys. So if you guys are using them in-game, use them like, to kill cavalry because they'll just ruin cavalry. But here they come again, the second time of asking... I've also found that chariots do tend to route quite early as well because obviously their numbers are low, aren't they? So if they lose a few men, it seems to the unit like they've lost a lot more than they have, if that makes sense. Yeah, I think that's rather same, if that's as, as you say, uh, same as the Rome one or, or in the original one. Yeah. It's always the most annoying thing when an elephant or a chariot unit just like routed after getting one casualty. Yeah. Okay, so we are getting Ooh. some units routing on yep. both sides, it seems. Your right flank is gone, but the middle and, the, well, the left flank is pretty strong right now. Yeah. I think okay. this is going to be a morale Good thing. Turn. It's going to be who, right who breaks it. first. Oh, this is such a mess. <laughs> this is... Oh, oh my days. <laughs> Oh. Well, that was... That was fun and brutal at the same time. <laughs> yeah. 
Jesus Christ. Oh my God. Well, I guess we've learned that the chariots are quite powerful. <laughs> yeah. True. Much more powerful in the, than in the original game. Yeah. Well, the scythe chariots anyway. The other chariots are rubbish, guys. Don't get the Carthaginian or the uh, Galatian chariots. They're, they're trash. But the scythe chariots, they are really good. Uh, but cool. Anyway, that was fantastic. Thank you very much for joining me, Quality Old Games. Uh, what a great, yeah, what a great battle! And as I say, guys, go and check his channel out. It's really cool. You, you guys are gonna love it. So go and check that out, and check it out for the other videos that are coming out in this little mini series.